Gary, it's me, Bug Girl, a.k.a. Brooke Thies. Ha! So I'm here to do your cameo shout out for you. So first of all, I want to say thank you so much for being such a huge fan of the Nightmare on Elm Street fan franchise. It is so near and dear to my heart. It was one of the first features that I ever shot. I was 18 years old, so it was um, quite special to me. So all my fans are quite special. So thank you, thank you, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Secondly, I wanted to talk about Robert because I know you're interested in what he's like. So Robert is like a walking encyclopedia. So if you were to name like an off, off, off Broadway play, he could name the actor, the writer, the producer, how long it ran for. He knows everything about anything in the business. So it's a really fun to go out to dinner with him. And whenever we do conventions, whoever is there from the Nightmare franchise, we die to go out to dinner with Robert so we can shoot the shit and chat and have a great time and just, you know, hear his fun anecdotal stories. He's been around for a very long time and he's quite the trained uh, actor, quite the thespian. And also, what's the cast like to work with? So the cast of Nightmare 4, just so you know, within the whole franchise of the Nightmare movies is known for their connection to each other. The Nightmare 4 gang is really a gang. So um, we all got together after we shot the film and we would hang out, we would have barbecues, and we are still friends to this day. And Toy is like my sister from another mister. I just adore her. We chat all the time and try to stay connected. And so those are kind of the, you know, fun little tidbits behind the scenes about uh, the cast. And what was my part like? I think that's what you were asking, my bug girl part. So it took about two and a half weeks to shoot. Uh, from beginning to end, from all the molds and um, all the prosthetics that I had to get fitted for. And then on the day of shooting, it took about three hours in makeup. So especially with when I had all the cockroach arms and I was, I manually controlled those. But then I also had like dripping flesh. And Screaming Mad George was the special effects uh, makeup artist. So he would airbrush like veins and blood and it was very detailed and uh it was uh really challenging to film it was probably one of the hardest shoots i've ever done practical um makeup is really intense and really labor intensive so it was fun and hard but i would do it again in a heartbeat anyway i am wishing you health and happiness and i wish you a really wonderful 2021. Thank you again. Bye.